Hello YouTube, how is everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome back to my playthrough of Scarface The World Is Yours. And on this part, we're gonna be doing the ending to the game, which Tony is gonna get revenge on Sosa once and for all. I hope that you guys like the cosplay. I, w I like to wear the suit that Tony wears at the beginning for the ending also, and wearing the suit also in real life. So thank you guys for watching this series, and if you guys enjoy this, please do drop a like. It does help the series out a lot. Final reputation level. We have completed all the letters in Scarface, all exotics not unlocked, all suppliers unlocked, all weapons unlocked. And now this phone call to Sosa is gonna be really good, you see how angry and desperate he's gotten. The world will remember your name. You should have died a long time ago, Tony. You want a war with me, you fucking little monkey? I'll give you a war you will never forget. This phone call is over, man. This phone call is over, man. So, the the thing about that is that, notice how in the, um... Notice how in the mov movie, it was Tony that was getting, like, really angry on the phone and impatient. But now Sosa is the one who's getting really impatient and angry on the phone, and Tony's just really calm. He's like, this call is over. That's it. Like, he just doesn't, doesn't want to uh, deal with Sosa anymore, and you see, you, you heard how desperate Sosa is getting, so go to Bolivia. This is gonna be good. This is what fans of the movie, a lot of fans, wanted to happen. Leading up to this moment. That's Sosa's theme. Gentlemen, I wish to discuss something that is of interest to all of us here. I have a problem. We have a problem. Uh, get to the point, Alex. Montana's been a fly on our shit ever since you sent your hit squad to Miami. Since then, he's been on a goddamn mission to personally fuck us in the ass. Yes. Well, I might remind you that you haven't been any more successful at taking care of Montana than I have, Mr. Gomez. Hey! I never had a problem with him until you stirred the pot. I hold you responsible, Alex. And the only reason I'm here is to make sure that I get a deal out of this. Ah, fuck. Why don't you two stop bickering about who fucked up where and put your money where your mouth is? Sosa, you have connections with the military here. Give him some money and roll some tanks on the... Press. That's Tony's scumbag Do lawyer who betrayed him. Our friends in Washington would approve of Bolivian tanks on the streets of Miami, George. Fuck Washington. I got them in my back pocket. A few greenbacks spread to the right hand. You make them look the other way for a day, never hurt anybody. Jesus Christ, you fucking lawyers are all the same. Montana has declared war on everybody in Miami, and he's obviously not going to stop until he steps into this goddamn living room. <laughs> That's good. They're satisfying when you just hear them panic. This is the hardest mission. Um, probably I think the hardest mission in the game. I would say. Running here, there's health. You want to try to get your rage filled up a lot in this mission. It'll help tremendously. See you at hand. Got the fucking head. Doctor, come on. Fuck you. Bueno. See you at hand. Eso no es justo. Now you're gonna fucking die. Oh fuck, okay. You let them. You want more? Okay, come on. Your horse. You think you can take me? Die. Look at you now. Como te gusta. Okay, so these are the last of the guys in the courtyard.
Tony, baby, hey, hey, come on. You need to think about this. You gotta think a little more. Fuck you, George, you fucking worm. Put the fucking gun away. What are you, crazy? Why are you, are you on drugs? <laughs> well, yeah, I guess, okay, well. Prepare to fucking die. Yeah, so George definitely deserves this, but I'm gonna show you guys something. There's actually three ways to actually kill George. You can use the AK-47. Fuck me in the ass. This is my law, George. Let me show you the other two ways. This is the other way to kill him with the deagle. Fuck me in the ass. This is my law, George. And there's one secret final way to kill him. So now let me show you guys the final way to kill him. My favorite one, fists. Fuck me in the ass. This is so satisfying. This is my law, George. Scumbag lawyer. If he hadn't ever betrayed Tony, everything would have been fine. Bust a hole right into Sosa's front door. Get some health, you get them in these little houses uh, right here. Holy shit, Montana, how the fuck did you get here? How many babies have you eaten today, Gaspar, huh? Babies? What the fuck are you talking about? You still fucked up on your own supply? Fucking addict. You have no respect for this business. All I care about is Sosa's head on a platter to serve to the fucking dogs. Fucking prick! So Gaspar is gonna constantly keep running in this part, and you gotta keep moving. You stay in one part for too long, they will pin you down. Try to build rage as, as quickly as you can. Key to surviving this mission is rage. Um, a lot of people uh, complain about this mission because they say it's so hard, which it is. But I like it because it's Sosa's compound. It's the final mission of the game. It's supposed to be hard. it's over, Gaspar. It's over for you now. You hear? That's it for Gaspar. So is all that's left. Clear that house. Last of his guards. You stupid fuck! That's it. Your turn, Cameron. That was a picture of Sosa from the movie, too. So, I love this part. How's this going to work, Tony? How do we solve our problem? You're going to die, Alex, for everything you've done in your entire life. <laughs> what about what you did? I told you not to fuck me, and you did, Tony. There were kids in the fucking car, Alex! Innocent kids, huh? What kind of animals you got working for you? I want to clear something up with you, Tony. 
before I kill you. When you move 400 kilos a month, it's imperative that you do kill children. That way, heroes don't get confused and go on 60 minutes. They instead crawl back into the hole they came from. Hey, Sosa! Maybe it's time for you to make Sosa's call, an huh? evil monster. My you stupid friend. fuck! Okay! You like that? Come on! No! So now in this part, um, you actually see Tony's see, actually carrying I Sosa's head. I never noticed that. Mafia Game Videos did um, a video on that explaining that. Let me leave, Tony. I need to support my family. It's all I got. Hey, look at me. I want to see your eyes. It's the truth. I swear. Please. You want a job, man? <laughs> that that scene was a big Easter egg to the movie, like what he did with Ernie when he gave him a job instead of killing him. Florida is a state of mind. Ah, oh, look at this bullshit! Who deserves to be on TV? Me! That's who! Who should be on every fucking magazine cover? Me! Family! Me! You got that right, baby. Vodka for Venus, gin for Tony. Hey, thanks, money. And you don't mind if I call you money, do you? Call me whatever you want, Tony. Okay, how about stupid fuck? Are you like that, huh? <laughs> Just kidding, money. You know, the world is yours, chico, and everything in it. So say goodnight to the bad guy. Love how they play the theme at the end. This game was supposed to get a sequel, but it got cancelled. But at least Tony's story ends happily in this game. But, um, uh, I guess that's it then, um, uh, guys. I will still have a few, um, uh, a few parts of Scarface up. I want to show you guys, like, the largest deal that you can- Oh, great. Cabana cigars under attack right when my playthrough is about to, um, uh, right when my playthrough is about to end. Wonderful, right? Okay, and this save Cabana cigar here. No! You like them? Shit! Come on, man! I tell you, you know. Don't shoot, man! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Fuck you! Do not! Oh shit! Ten more of these guys, but yeah, sucks that right, right here, my uh business got attacked. See you in hand. Chainsaw enemies, of course. What's that NPC doing? This isn't funny anymore. What were you shooting at? You finally set me off. There we go. Front has been saved. Now, um, uh, what I was trying to um uh, say, guys, is that I will still have like a video up on like the largest drug deal that you can make in this game. Um, so like I'll have like the largest sale possible. Like talking a little bit about how I hope like you know the next GTA, if it does do Vice City, like implements a system similar to Scarface. This is such an underrated open world game. It's such a great game. Um, a lot of fun with this game. Um, also, I think I'll have a mish a video on the driver, the enforcer, and the assassin. I think I'll have separate videos for all of those um, all those roles. So um, thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed this series. Make sure you check out the Scarface movie if you've never seen the Scarface movie because it explains basically um, what leads, leads up to this game. This game takes place after the um, uh, after the uh, the movie. Uh, but anyways, what Tony was basically talking about at the end there 
is he said that there was kids in the car because Sosa wanted him to uh, help um, Alberto um, blow up this um, guy that was going to speak at the United Nations, that was going to speak out against the cartels, um, especially against um, Sosa. And um, what happened was kids got into the car and Tony didn't want to detonate it. And Sosa's guy, Alberto, wanted to detonate it. And so Tony killed him. And the guy gave the speech at the UN. And that was the whole reason that Sosa went after him. It was the only good thing that Tony did in the entire movie is what got him killed in the movie. But in the game, he ends up surviving. And so that's that goes to show you that Tony, as bad of a guy he is, and he is a bad guy, he's not evil. And there's a big difference between bad and evil. Tony's just a bad guy. But Sosa, on the other hand, is evil. Not caring if he's going to kill kids... It's just, what a monster, horrible human being. But um, that was very satisfying at the end, Tony just messing him up and just getting revenge on everybody. So thank you guys for watching. Hope that you guys enjoyed this series as much as I did. Um, next game that we're going to be doing is going to be Modern Warfare Remastered. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys had a lot of fun watching this, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care, everyone.